Colonel Jeffrey Williams, introduce yourself, please. Uh, my name is Colonel Jeff Williams. I'm an astronaut with NASA. What is it like for a, a human being to walk in space and uh, what are these feelings about mankind once he come back? Your personal experience. Uh, it's absolutely incredible to, uh, to go to space uh, and to be on board the space station orbiting the Earth and, and being able to see the Earth from that vantage point. It's uh, completely beyond that, though, to even go outside and climb around the outside of the space station in a spacesuit and be a satellite yourself. Just an incredible experience. When you are uh, up above Earth, uh, your perspective changes enormously. What is the next challenge for mankind, in your opinion? Uh, well, the history of civilization is the history of exploration and discovery. So our current space exploration is just the, the, the current chapter of, of that history. Uh, I don't know exactly where the history will go or where it will go in the future, uh, but certainly we have this desire inside of us to understand the world around us and we'll continue in that pursuit. Your experience uh, seeing the earth from above makes you feel more like a, a citizen of the earth and not just of the uh, USA or Europe or Sicily or Italy. Certainly it gives you a different perspective uh, being up there and seeing the entire globe uh, 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 from a single vantage point in orbiting the earth every, every uh, uh, 90 minutes. Uh, the earth, uh, you have a sense of home uh, being the earth, especially being off the planet. Uh, and that sense is overwhelming when you return to Earth. Even though you're in the middle of nowhere, halfway around the world from where I live in Kazakhstan, I had this sense of being home. Um, how long will it take to develop the proper technology for a man to be able to be sent to Mars and back? A uh, Mars mission will largely depend upon the political will to do so. It will take, of course, a lot of work and technology development to do so but that requires funding, so it, it, and it boils down to the political will. Um, my guess is that it is, is at least decades away. You've been in a space for more than 500 days. Uh, ever wish to return? Uh, what are your plans about it? Uh, I don't know exactly. I'm a grandfather now, so I certainly include the family in my plans, but I also accept the responsibility to vicariously share the experience um, of space flight uh, to communicate that to the people of the earth. Um, I am a, a Christian. I'm a believer in the Bible. I've been studying it for years and I, I uh, am working harder and harder to better communicate the, the, uh, the integrated uh, truth that you can see from uh, studying the earth from the vantage point of, of, uh, of orbit uh, through the lens of scripture. Uh, the revealed truth of God. Okay, thank you very much. All right, thank you.